the most exciting head coach to me was the New York Jets hired Adam Gase. And I think this is a fantastic, fantastic move. In my opinion, Adam Gase was fired way too prematurely in Miami. I thought really unjustly fired from the, by the Miami Dolphins. And so I love that the New York Jets, a division rival of the Miami Dolphins, were able to pick him up. I think that is fantastic. Um, look, I understand why Adam Gase was fired by the Dolphins. He was 23 and 25 in his three seasons there. But you got to understand, Adam Gase never had the right quarterback in Miami. He had ran Tannehill for three years. He was hurt every year. One year, he didn't play the entire season. They had to bring in Jay Cutler. Literally, here's how good of a coach Adam Gase is. This is for some perspective. He won a bunch without Adam, Ryan Tandle, without his, quote, franchise quarterback, who, in my opinion, never panned out. But Adam Gase won games with Brock Osweiler at quarterback. I feel like that's enough said. You won games with Brock Osweiler, you can do anything. I think he's a great offensive mind. I think he's a wonderful head coach that, again, never really got a fair chance in Miami because of the problems the Dolphins had at quarterback. I know you can say, well, if Adam Gase is a quarterback guy, why wasn't Ryan Tannehill a better quarterback? A coach can only do so much. There's two ends of the bargain. The coach has to do his side. The quarterback has to do his part. Ryan Tannehill was never healthy. He didn't seem to quite develop as he should have with understanding of defenses. That's just work in the offseason. His accuracy kind of sucked. And I just, I think that Adam Gase never got a fair shot in Miami. I'm so glad he's going to the man, uh, to the New York Jets. I think the Jets are a great fit. Him and Sam Darnold. Sam Darnold has a great offensive coach. And Adam Gase finally has the quarterback he's always wanted with Sam Darnold. It's a great match. I think Adam Gase is going to be a home run with the New York Jets. In fact, I really think that this is now the beginning of the end for the Patriots dynasty. The AFC East, the Patriots division is getting much better. The Buffalo Bills have Josh Allen, their franchise quarterback. The Jets just got a great head coach. They have Sam Darnold, their franchise quarterback. I think, and Tom Brady's getting older, this is the beginning of the end for the New England Patriots. They still got a couple of years in the tank. But very soon, Josh Allen and or Sam Darnold is going to be dominating the AFC East. And we might forget very quickly about the New England Patriots. Oh, I, I hate doing this. It makes me feel uncomfortable. I really don't like self-promotion. It makes me feel like a used car salesman. But I got to do it. So if you don't know, this is my podcast, Strong Opinion Sports. It's my favorite thing in the world. And you can subscribe on iTunes, SoundCloud. You can find it on YouTube. You can find the full entire hour-long podcast on YouTube. You can also find shorter breakout clips like the one you just watched. Please do me a favor. If you like anything I had to say, maybe you hate me and you're mad about something. Share this podcast with your friends. Share it on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, whatever you want to do. Help me grow by telling your friends about this show.